Look at all this. We had so much help today. Look at all this. Got most of the walls out, lower half of the walls. Most of the the uh, floorboards that were wet. All the old furniture and instant pots and things. Uh, got, got a lot of yucky wet floor. And this is what's left that we actually moved back in because they took out all the walls of the garage. This was not how the garage looked before. I parked my car in here. It looks like the washer's working. I ran one load and the dryer had a, a tube full of water over here. So there it is. Um, but yeah, this is, uh, this is what it's like. Still got some walls left to take out. But, uh, but yeah, this is a new section that the sellers of the home built in this garage office of ours. But yeah, you can see where the waters were high. Still got work to do to get rid of that stuff. I think, I don't even know how that works. I'm shutting this. Oh, something in the way. Anyway, the office area, you know, things and haven't finished. Oh, yeah. See, those used to be white baseboards. <laughs> yes. And this is all the stuff, all the things we have, yeah. And yeah, you can see, like I didn't even know we had an outlet in there. Look at that. I could have strung up a light all this time. Ellen's wedding dress got saved, that's good. Husband, husband did that because, you know, try to save things. Um, somebody packed up my office, which is kind of embarrassing because, you know, uh, not too, not too uh, tidy. Uh, Ellen and I share that. But yeah, this is what it looks like now, people. Pretty crazy. All of our walls taken out, floors taken out. This is all, all today. Most all today. And uh, we had some old termite damage in that corner. I was like, what? But most, mostly fine. Uh, that's the only spot where that showed up there. So <clears throat> it looked old, but anyway, yeah. This bathroom, we haven't even touched that, really, except to take off the front face of the door. And we're just blowing fans and stuff. And it looks like the moisture is slowly depleting. Our AC seems to be working. Uh, even though the pump outside was totally underwater. So, yeah, pretty interesting. It's pretty overwhelming, to be honest. I'm like, what? Is there a cold and hot water manifold, apparently. Um, I don't even turn this thing on yet, but maybe I should. Anyway, um, this is what it's like. We got a little bit of floor left here to do. Some floor in there. It's hard to remember what these things even were, but man, we had kids in here doing this. This is awesome. They did an amazing job. I mean, like, minors, we'll say. Uh, instead of, uh, there aren't kids, all of them. But, uh, but yeah, you can see there's a lot of water damage in here. So I even broke one of these windows. But uh, we're making progress, you know. Even figured out why the fridge wasn't on it it feels cold up top but uh i don't know if the freezer's working that's kind of sad and uh that's pretty much a wrap we oh we have a little bit left in here oh man yeah here's the master bedroom and looks like drying out okay no. So yeah, we got our work cut out for us. We still got things up above, but we'll have to pack those. But we are so grateful for all the people that showed up. I mean, it was a mass of people. Um, and really awesome, I'm telling you. And uh, just felt really cared for and loved. And just like the fact that one of our friends, her favorite moment was realizing that I don't know. I don't know if I'm saying it right. I'm not even using the right words, probably. But she was just like, yeah, I was so glad that I could be a part of, like, 
the church, God's family, um, uh, be a part of the body of Christ and just like be here and do, do church here, um, instead of like traditional kind of Sunday thing. So that was really sweet, you know, cause I, I believe that too. Like I just love being able to go out there and be the church and show up, you know, when I can. And today I realized he even said, you know, you get to carry not things in and out, but emotions. And that's pretty much what I did and answered questions. And uh, that was hard, but, uh, but we're gonna be okay, you know? And, uh, and so, yeah, we still need, you know, all your prayers, of course, for those friends of ours out there who pray and just um, really, grateful for your just thoughts and messages shared towards us. I'm shutting the last window for the night. Um, and uh, yeah, just really excited about what will be, you know, like what will this place be later? Hopefully maybe restored. <laughs> Reversing the curse of the flood, you know, um, that's kind of, yeah, I like that phrase. We use that with some of the men that I um, work with and do life with. And so, redemptively. So anyway, love you guys. I'm going to cut this video short because it's already too long. And, uh, oh, look at this. Like, we get to borrow this valley bar that Maddie Mae will love using because, uh, yeah. She may not be able to go to ballet sometimes. Well, you know, at least this week. Can't, I think. I mean, not sure. Anyway, but our friend brought that too from Orlando. Love you guys. Thank you so much. And uh, so grateful to, to all you guys who came out and helped today. And all y'all send in your love and care and um, even financial gifts. And yeah, thank you. Love you guys. And uh, we still got a haul, but uh, we're, we're making our way. Feels good. And uh, love you. Thanks, bye.